Welcome, I'm Michael B. I hope you are doing great today. If you're new to this channel, please consider to subscribe and or leave a comment. And while we're at it, smash that like button and the notification bell too. I will surely bring you more videos on simulation, survival and strategy games every week. If you've been here before, welcome back! Well, hello there fellow farmers, welcome back to uh, Richie's Hollow, welcome back to another episode. Now, uh, last time out we uh, we got the silo, so we're able to produce a lot of signage to bring in some money, and I'm doing a lot of grass, a lot of mowing. As you can see, it's almost full, and I've just turned in some of the grass I've been cutting over far, far end there. Um, yeah, it takes a sweet time, so once we've gotten it all, it has almost regrown. So, uh, yeah, that's pretty good. Um, we're gonna start down at the coal mine today. So, what's going on down here? Well, I actually, I started to... Um, to throw in some rocks. I've been delivering some diesel uh, of all the good things we have produced. And we already had some water from last time. So, that's awesome. And, uh, yeah, let's see how much we... Uh, produced I think I, we already got some right yes yes so uh, how much we got yeah 800,000 units so uh, we can go to the uh, mammoth mill and fill it up with the coal that's one thing and we also need to iron mine to get going uh, I bought this uh, cool little uh, wheel loader from uh, NMC um, I've been showing it off in my mods review, but we can take a look at it, no problems. It's a little beefed up, it's a little faster than the normal one. I mean, the arms move a little faster and just it, it uh, articulates uh, faster. And uh, what's the horsepower? 300? Uh, and it's 224, the strongest one we have in game. Uh, 234, yeah, 34. So it's a little bit better on all fronts and of course if you ask me a good set of lightning it's very important down here at the coal mine i'm gonna take the flatbed and then i'm just gonna show you how i'm gonna do it with the rocks you can do it whatever you like to do and let's see it's on rocks it's on rocks activate it and just drive around a little carefully. It holds nine pieces of rocks. There we go, seven, eight, nine. And just do something like this. Yoink. And moving on. Take the next one. Yeah, well, okay. <laughs> Don't activate the autoload. Unless you are out of reach for what you just unloaded. Note one. Silly man. Yep, so I hope you had a wonderful week. I had a very, very busy week. So I'm not happy about only making one video per week now, but uh, it was needed. New job is really demanding right now. I guess every job is once you just start it so many things to learn so many things to remember and people to talk to and new colleagues and potential new friends and but it's when it's really been been wonderful I love it so awesome and I can also get a little bit of a breather for playing video games it is needed from time to time. Right. Then we got some rocks placed down here. I'm gonna jump in the auto auto load. No, the wheel loader. And uh, this silage grab here. It's uh, vanilla. Or in game stuff does the job perfectly. It even registers the uh, the stones when you touch them. You look at it on in the corner, it says co rock. Hey, and actually, it grabs two of them sometimes, it gets stuck. 
You can lift the rocks. Yep, there we go. <laughs> Defying the laws of physics. Yep. There we go. And I'll just shove the rocks in here. Uh, we have... Uh, we don't have so much money right now, but I am thinking that uh, we're going to sell a lot of uh, signage. And then possibly going to buy the um, the iron mine. And of course we're going to buy the uh, mammoth mill. So uh, that's going to be the, uh, the goal of today. Get the mammoth mill up running. Ah, a little more coffee. Oh, coffee is needed. Uh, uh. Ah, my shoulder. All right, there we go. Hanging up this old buddy. I think we can. Uh, I think the better option would be if we just take the truck. We don't need to drive around with this. Right, there we go. Oops. Wrong button. All right, let's get a cold delivery to the uh, mammoth mill. Going. Um, I forgot where I parked my uh, tanker. Oh yeah, I think it's just outside here. Yes, there it is. Just delivered the diesel. So, uh, yeah, let's get going. Let's see what the Mammoth Mill can uh, give us of, uh, opportunities. A lot, I should think. Uh, first and foremost, it's right over here. Yes, we need to buy it, I know. So, um, we have to sell some diesel. Um... Need to figure out where we need to deliver stuff. It's in here, right? So, as far as I remember, coal needs to go here. I don't think we can unload anything before we we bought the land. Nope. All right. How much was it? It was four hundred and something, as far as I remember. Um, uh, mammoth milk. Yes, four hundred and eleven. All right. Let's jump into the tanker. There we go. It's full of diesel. 500,000 units. Yes, I think we can We can unload it here. Um, can we not? Is it I? Start filling. No, unload. Uh, empty. Why did I load it up? Huh? I'm a little bit confused. What did I do last time? Start overloading. What did I... Okay, well, anyways. Now we're unloading diesel, and we're gonna get some more from up at Eleanor's. And we're gonna sell that lot down at Tony Tires. Tony's Tires, I think he was the one who gave us the best fries. There we go. Mm, nope, Jim Auto. And farm sales. Well, that was pretty far away, isn't it? Uh, no, actually not. So up at Eleanor's, down, around, and over to Jim's Autos. All right. We can do that. We can do that. And I've also been on the Giants Mud Hub. Oh my goodness, it's just exploded with mods, right? There's so many. Um, didn't really find any just, hey, pick me, I'm really excellent, in my opinion. Um, but there is some that we can play around with next time around. We're just doing a little, a little bit of a collection. Uh, no, not here next time, isn't it? Yes, it is. But there was also the first Danish map I saw, Islands of Femur, as you call it. 
Um, that's really cool. I need to look into that map. Because I'm very curious. Jeez. Alright. Excellent driving. Try it one more time. Alright, I guess you finished unloading. Yes, you did. And we're gonna start fill you up. How much we got? Uh, 645. That's fine. Cool. It's gonna be in uh, a good profit. So hopefully we can buy the uh, the iron mine and the... Uh, what was it again we needed to buy? Hmm. What was it? What was I thinking? No, I forgot. I wanted to buy something. What was it? It was needed. Um, the ore. The, the ore mine and the... And the uh, mammoth mill. Is that it? I guess that's it. Alright. Yep, yeah, it's always good when you can confuse yourself. Really good. Right, let's get down to the... Um, Jim's auto shop and uh, sell a lot of diesel. Oh no. Hmm. 248. Yeah, that's not much. Hmm. I am running hard economy. So, <laughs> kinda knew it wouldn't be that much, but I had hoped for a little bit more. Whoa. Right, um, I think we need to go to sell some mm, signage. Huh, yeah. Mm, we could, however, you know what, let's go get some more diesel. Uh, we're gonna fill the truck up, gonna, gonna take the last diesel, and then we're gonna go buy the iron mine. Gonna fill up the iron mine so it can start producing the uh or rocks and uh, at least we got that going because we might need to dig deep into the silage uh, stock we have in order to have money enough to buy the uh the mammoth mill yeah gonna do that and this is the wrong one no that's the right way oh, jeez all right, see you in a few. All right, I arrived at the ore mine, so we need to buy it. So let's do that. It can't be that bad, can it? Where's the price? Where's the price? Uh, there. 190. Okay. Fine. Fine, fine, fine. We own it. Hooray! Yay! Right. Um, we'll start producing some ore then. And... Uh, top up with some diesel and then I'm gonna go into the uh, the liquid facility or the liquid silos we have filled up this trailer and then I'm gonna sell some more diesel uh, I'm gonna have a little issue with the coal because these mammoth mill can't hold that much coal so we might need to invest in a silo and I have been told by Dixie that everything should be able to be stored uh, up at the area that we own up here. Wasn't that the area? Yeah, up here. Um, that's very nice to know. However, I still want to uh, get things, uh, you know, just centralized down here. So uh, we're going to spend a little more money. We're going to spend a little more money on uh, a quarry silo that can hold coal there we go yes it's only forty five thousand. <laughs> only and only yeah i'm uh, gonna place you yeah now we're parking a little bit in the way that's be that'd be fine I'm gonna put you there i think there we go perfect uh let's 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 yeah let's what 
Let's get no more diesel. Alright, fill it up. Alright, there we go. Gonna go back to Tony's. Um, gonna sell diesel. Gonna put all of the uh, coal in the storage. And then we're gonna sell a lot of silage. So I'll be right back. Selling the truckload of diesel gave us 143. Well, 127. Uh, so now we're up to 143,000. Ah, still a long way. We still need another 300,000. Hopefully, we're gonna get that with the diesel. Ah, uh, not the diesel. The uh, signage. Close. Same. Yeah. Oh no, got tired. Oh, we've been working you so hard. Oh, yeah, that's a good thing. Um, okay. <laughs> Anyways, we are on the way to get the signage. The uh, whole load. Come on, give it to me. Yep, four million and eight hundred thousand, and it holds five million. So yeah, it's gonna take a little time, but hopefully it's gonna solve our money issues. And we are almost there. That was uh, that's quite quite the, the load here. Uh, yes, that's all. And the best price is at the barn. All right, we need to go. It's not that far away. Um, I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but that mountain, huh? Yeah, I always get the association with the uh, the movie Close Encounter of the Third Degree. Is that what it's called? It really looked like. Could be that mountain, couldn't it? Is that something, old man? Hmm? Is that something? I might need to ask him. Let's see. Let's see how much money we're gonna get from this. Ah, it looks looks promising. Okay, it looks very promising. And that's it. 1.2 million. Ah, all warriors just suddenly disappeared. That was really nice. This was what exactly what I hoped for. Let's go spend them right away. <laughs> we got some money, let's spend them. Uh, yes, uh, the sawmill will bite. Yes, please. Good. So now we can see what it's all about. And I think even we get, we're gonna, we're gonna have uh, Tom's tables and Bob's uh, books in the bargain, right? No, Bob's is here. So what is this one? Oops. Uh, this is the warehouse one. Oh yeah, this, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the little warehouse here. We can store a lot of stuff. Oh yeah, Tom's tables. Yes, that's correct. And the mammoth mill. Yeah. So, well, hello, Tom. We are your new owner. Let's see if we can uh, get a good bargain out of you. Get a good collaboration. I think it's uh, the more correct term. So let's uh, go get some coal. Yeah, and let's get that mammoth mill running. Uh, what? Where more do we need? I don't remember. We're gonna see. We're gonna see. You know, actually, we could uh, do something about this place here. I've done that in the previous uh, playthroughs. There's a lot of money to gain from these trees, and it's also an excellent place to place buildings. Because we are going to use this mammoth mill a lot. That is, well, if not the essential. It's uh, one of the essential uh, buildings uh, in all the production lines. Ex ex essentials is, is that a correct word? It's essential. I can't even pronounce it now. Anyways, gotten too much coffee. It's insane. This is a. Um, you know what I mean. Let's uh, let's pick up some coal here. Oh yeah, 
I don't remember if I hey, this is this is the issue when I'm recording just once a week. I can't remember what I told you guys last time around. Um if you are going to uh, pick up this coal here, at least when I am doing it, I am only able to uh, spawn up to 400,000 units. I mean, it's enough, right? Um, but once it reaches 400,000 units, it stops. The production stops. And it just waits for me to pick it up. It's not like it's broken or anything. It just stops. Now we got 100,000. And then we just have to remove everything. And then we just have to start all over again. Um, it's perfectly fine. I'm just wondering if I am the only one who's gonna get get those numbers. Uh, I mean, we're on one time now, so if we're gonna crank up the uh, time for, let's say, 120, you can see here the, uh, the coal is spawning. I mean, we can let it go up to 400,000. That's no issues. Uh, we got a lot of, yeah, we still got a lot of diesel. I think we'll be fine. Got a lot of water, and we still got a lot of coal. So you can see uh, the level of coal produced is uh, going up. Uh, we can even crank it up even more to super speed. Like that. Wink. And it now stops. You see? Well, the below is uh, 251,000. And it's just hither and there. Um, and we got, we got stuff. Still got diesel. Oh, it's going on. It's going on. Now it's just using diesel for producing stone. Ah, now it's night time. That's okay. Now I can show you the lights. Uh, okay. So once coal is stopped producing, the stone's gonna continue. That's fine. That makes sense. Um, but there should be 400,000 units here. Now uh, we're gonna go in here and turn this on. Because we need some lights. There we go. There is also a little thingy machine here. I can turn it on. Uh, I was taken a little by surprise. <laughs> it's not here. Where is it? Ah, I was looking for the uh, the Among Us. The Among Us wait. There's lights in the eye. Oh. Anyways. Uh, what I was looking for and I found the last time around is... Uh, I think I need to find this thingy machine here. It gives a lot of light. And it's pretty cool. It's pretty awesome. So why didn't I buy this? Well, there has been an update to it and I didn't have time for downloading it. Um, I had some issues with Cinder perfectly uh, when you put it on the front attacher. That should have been fixed by now. Um, but if you are having some issues with the lightning and you don't want to drive around in the Scania, go for this one. Uh, the mod is on the, on the Farming Simulator mod site. Um, it's pretty awesome. It gives a good, 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 good light. So uh, go do that if you are struggling with see something here down at, at the at night time. I will uh, suggest that. If I remember, I'm going to leave the link in the description. So let's see how much we're going to get from this. Gonna get 800. But it's only 400. It's gonna be 400. Because that's what it used to be. Yeah, 372. And we're going up to 400,000. Look at that. And now, and it continues because now everything is gone. So, I mean, 400,000. That's perfect. I'm not complaining. It's a good amount. There we go. Now we're gonna turn you off. And ratio up. I can't see diddly. Now I can't see anything. Yep, there we go. There we go. Oh, trees. Yeah, we haven't removed them yet. Gotta go in here in the uh, iron ore mine. Yep, there's a stone right there. Good. I'm gonna park it over here. Just gonna take care of this now. Right. Brilliant. I'm sorry if it's too dark for you to see. It shouldn't be. I'm gonna adjust the uh, settings a little bit, but we can jump into uh, daytime. I think we should do that. And eight o'clock in the morning, rising down here to the mammoth mill with the first load of coal. 
And then the rest we're gonna throw into the the um the silo. Zzz. Yeah, I went a little too far here. Oh, now we should be able to. Yep, there we go. That was the trigger. Code going right in here. Yoink. How much does it take? Uh oh. Do, 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 do. Where was it? Where did you go? Hello? 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 Where was Mill? There. Uh, uh, one million. Oh. Oh. Well, then I can bring more. And you could ah, you also take wood chips and straw. Ho, 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 ho. And wood chips as wood. And that's what it said. Now I understand. One more. And you need water. So actually... Actually, we need wood chips. And what did I say about that section over there? Wood chips. Let's go buy that. We still got the money, right? I hope so. Uh, yeah, no problem. We just sold a lot of silage. There we go. Now we're rolling. Now we're cooking with gas. Isn't that what you're saying? No, maybe not like that. Sound more like a mix up of American Australian. Yeah, cooking with gas. What the hell's going on around here? Anyways, not to make fun of anybody. My accent is not the greatest. <laughs> Don't want to make fun of anybody. It makes no sense to make fun of anybody. Right. So we're going to proceed with getting the ore mine up and running. And for that, we need to throw in some rocks. So we need the flatbed. We need to remove these trees and we need to get some uh, wood chips going to the uh, mammoth mill. All right, so that's gonna be quite the task. Well, at least now we got a plan. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> yep. Alright, turn you on. It shouldn't take that long to remove these trees here. Right, I'm throwing in some rocks. So we're gonna have some ore produced. Should be lovely. Yeah, it's the same deal, right? As we did before with the coal mine. The ore mine is exactly the same. Water and diesel. So that's it. Can we? Should we? Do we need to remove these trees? No. We just bought the new piece up at the uh, mammoth mill, so we're gonna take. A shot of this up there. Uh, once we have, uh, once we have thrown around with some stones. Right, flatbed is just over there. Whoops. Close call. Attaching, what are you talking about? Strange person, right? Activate this in you, and here we go. Hey, look at this! Pinky balls, or oh, what color are you want to prefer? There we go. And second round. So just uh, crank up time just a little bit more. So gonna have some more spawn. Well, we don't really need it, do we? I think 18 should do it first time around. If we have one, four, eight, eh, just about. Just need one more. There we go. 
One, two, three, four. Right, there we go. All the stones are in, and we are hopefully producing some iron ore. Yes, yes, no. What do we need? Oh, water. <laughs> yeah, of course we need water. Right, well, that can be fixed. That can be fixed. Go get some water from over here. Uh, should we install another in the arm? Nah. Nah. It's not necessary. Let's save those those 5,000 for something else. Just fill it up. There we go. Hey, look at that. Look at that. We're having some ore produced. Or what is what is it actually called? It's called ore rock. Okay. Ore rock. That's ore rock. Yep. Brilliant. Brilliant. Alright, we need more water. So while you are producing, we're gonna go get some wood chips uh, done so hopefully when we're done with the wood chips we're gonna have a lot of coal and uh, ore and everything should be fine i got follow me uh, i thought i did still not okay well doesn't matter i mean we actually don't need this truck we could we could park it here. We'll be ready. Um, and then we can just take the memory tree here and fill it up because it's got the capacity of what was it? Three million? Five million? I don't remember. I think it was three million of wood chips. So we don't really need. Let me lower you. Oh, not lower you. Raise you. There we go. Right, let's do that. Let's uh, let's do a lot of wood chips. All right, a little bit change of plans. We're gonna get the uh, the ore first, then we're gonna deliver the ore, and then we got an empty tr truck, and then we can get the wood chips from up at the uh, members mill. Then we can deliver the wood chips, not the other way around. It's a logistic nightmare sometimes. Right, let's get you uh, going here. How much are we going to get here? I expect 400,000 as the max. Don't know if we got 400,000. Looks like it. Eh, yeah, more or less. I think we got it actually because we already delivered something in the trailer. That's fine, 400,000, that's, uh, that's a start. Maybe we should just uh, crank up time a lot. Just to get going. I mean, it holds, what was it, 1 million? Yeah. And night time comes around. Looks like we're done already. Yes. Yoink. Eh, more or less. Four, five, six, seven. Just one more. Nope, block, block. It's a spawning area for stones down here as well. Oh. Well, there we go. Let's continue to the early morning. There we go. Perfect. Hey. Well. All right. I thought we were safe from stone spawning down here. Apparently not. That's fine. Then we know. Right. That should be one million, more or less. Perfect. 
park you here. Done for now. Thank you for your service. <laughs> ah, well, 866. Oh yeah, well, close to a million. It's good enough. Good enough for now. And we managed to get actually a fair chunk of trees. Just uh, spent, I don't know, five, ten minutes with the mail rig. And we got six, seven hundred units of wood chips, I think it was. And there is something with the tree mail rig and the stumps on this map. They are not quite, uh, they're not quite compatible. You can see there are stumps here and there and I can't remove them. No matter what I do, so I might need to go back to the brooks. I'm sorry, but uh, yeah. Oh, both of them. Yeah, okay, makes sense. If we're gonna deliver coal up there and it's one unit, then both of these are gonna show. Alright, okay. Okay. Sure. Let's see. Um, isn't that an overview overall? No? Hmm. Uh, pipe. Coal. <laughs> or, yeah. Hmm. Alright. But we still need some wood chips. We still need some wood chips. We are almost there, guys and girls. We are almost there. There we go. How much right? You see, we took a little. Just a little teeny tiny some trees. I don't know how much. How many? 30, 40 trees? Ish. Oh, you're taking your sweet time to unload. Right. So. I'm gonna swing in here. With a lot of wood chips. Right there. Perfect. Yep, there we go. So, it should be ready up and running. Unless. Nah, we still need water. We still need some water. Right, let's go get the tanker. Now I am fan of uh, Winston's pack, cat mud, mud, cat mud pack, mud pack, mud pack, cat. <laughs> I'm just saying that a few times. <laughs> I'm a fan of uh, Winston's cat pack. Uh, got a tanker that holds uh, what was it, five million units of water, and that's uh, that's a good thing to have because we are using a lot of water. However, that mud pack is unfortunately throwing. A lot of errors on the map. I have no idea why. That's sometimes the uh, the fun of uh, using mods. You don't really know what the error is. Just throwing some errors. Um, so I'm not using it. Could be handy now though. Where is that water thingy, Michini? Did we find one last time around? Oh yeah, over here the uh, the rowboats. There we go. Right. But I still didn't find a place to unload it. Hmm. Well, we're gonna look for a tower. It is the only thing we need still, right? Uh, paper line, wood, coal is running. Yeah, needs water. And the steel line needs ore, coal and water. All right. Time for a little coffee. Ah, magnificent. All right, come on, you.
There we go. Just to get you going. And where is the water supposed to be, I think? Well, we got a tower there, so I am thinking water needs to go here. Uh-huh. Good thinking. Yep. A tower like that almost definitely means here goes the water. I don't know if that's a blue plastic barrel there is indicating something as well. But yeah, we found it. We found everything. So iron over there, water here, and wood chips down there. And you are ready, set to go. And it's also taking what was it? Straw? And. Oh, I forgot now. Wood chip straw, and what was it? Something cool as well. Oh, I don't even have to go here. Didn't even have to go here. Uh, that was the lumber line. Coal, wood chips, and straw. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Ow. Excellent. Yeah, we got this. We got the mammoth mill up running. That's really lovely. I expected it took like two hours or something, but it's only been one hour. And it's just exactly on the one hour episode mark here of me recording. The episode's gonna be a little bit shorter due to obvious reasons and cutting here and there when I'm coughing or doing strange things, saying mumble jumbo stuff. You know, stuff, technical term for mumbling. Yeah. Right, anyways. Uh, next time? Hmm. Very good question. Next time around, well, I think uh, well, we are going to be producing some plywood uh, so we can get the beehives going. That could bring a little bit more money. That would be lovely. Um, otherwise, I think we could go for the cement plant. Uh, that is one of the base ingredients for building some factories here there and there so I think we're gonna do that and then I'm gonna get the um, the rock crusher and the cement plant up running and then more or less getting bought uh, or buying the other mines the nickel mine sooner or later and you know just to get it get it running make it ready uh, the copper mine as well um, because we are going to be using that in a production line sooner or later. Right. So, excellent. I thank you very much for watching. I really appreciate it. And until next time, then please take care, stay safe and be cool. Bye.